What's going on Halo Freaks and Geeks? It's just your buddy Cleanup here with another Halo 4 exclusive commentary. The person you're seeing on the screen is actually not myself. It is a guy by the name of Clutchism. His gamer tag is obviously in the score description. So if you want to request him as a friend and play, I would definitely suggest that. He is a good buddy of mine and also a fellow YouTuber. His channel will also be in the description below. He's not a casual guy like I'm my, myself or like uh, Crouching Spartan. He is more of a uh, a competitive player, and he's starting to get more into the casual aspect to where he's helping like train players and other things like that, and and kind of giving uh, strategies and tips. Like for instance, like I went up to him when we were talking about this gameplay, and I asked him. I said, you know, what's what's your setup for this? Like, what, what is your overall goal? And he said, well, the first thing is, there are a lot of things running through my mind all at the same time. And what he says was, I could go three minutes deep into why I put a nade in a certain place. And, and I said, well, that's pretty cool. Like, are you really, like, that in-depth with, like, your thought? And he says, yeah, it happens. Like, a split second, you constantly have to think about, like, where they're spawning, where you can place nades. Uh, when is the next uh, like ammo pickup and other things like that? Like when when can I pick up snipe? When can I pick up sword or shoddy, or you know scatter shot? He starts off with a nice little overkill. He even gets a little sticky swag from long distance. I really haven't seen a whole lot of long distance nade throws like that, as far as sticks go, since especially on this map, since like Halo 2. You used to see it all the time with like. Abused Goat or Nakamura and stuff like that. It was just really fun. And seeing that long distance stick from one tower to the next is just great. And he said his setup on this, sorry to get off topic, he said his setup on this is quite easy. He said, you know, all I really do is I have somebody on BR tower, somebody on snipe tower, and then the two people kind of in the middle and, and backing the other guys up. And what it does is it forces spawn into bottom blue and elbow. The elbow is like the ramp going up to snipe one. So it really forces them into uh, a dilly of a pickle, if I may. And uh, I'll tell you what, like he, he just has strategies for every map. On his channel, it, it's mostly clips and other things like that of him and his brother doing work. Um, he is currently enrolled into college, so right now he's not doing a whole lot of I would say YouTube stuff, but what he is doing is he's gaming. Like, so what happens is I, I, I get online, and he's usually online after he's done with his job or internship. And, like, when we play together, it, like, takes my game to a whole nother level because he's, he's explaining, and he's constantly telling me, like, what to do or whatever. He's not, like, demanding or anything like that. Don't get me wrong. But he just lets you know, like, before, if you want to win, if you want to be able to take your game to the next level, if you want to, uh, you know, figure out some of the thought process behind gaming, then, you know, he'll suggest things to you, like, hey, you know, push red, or, hey, you know, um, drop down low tower and then uh, back me up, or whatever. He's not, like, demanding. He doesn't call you a scrub. He's not, like, very critical. He's one of the most down-to-earth, competitive guys that I've ever met. Because, trust me, those are hard to find. Battle Royale was a great success. Crossman and Modest Major were the winners. So congrats to them. They were awesome. I'm actually going to show the finals gameplay. Um, and actually do commentary over it. Uh, slash listen-ins and other things like that. It should be really fun. The next Battle Royale, I'm just going to give you one simple hint, and that's it. And then I'm out of here. I got to go. It's Sunday. I got to spend time with my family. You know, do the whole praise Jesus thing, and then I got to get out of here. This next Battle Royale, just prepare to be cranked, all right? That does it for me, guys. I'm out of here. I'll check you later.